Welcome back to Carol Steele Action Plan. I'm Carol Steele. I wasn't going to film today really because I'm watching Money in the Bank. And I don't want to put up predictions earlier, but I didn't because we were doing stuff for Father's Day. So, get some stuff out and we'll start going. So I like to make breakfast burritos sometimes because you can just freeze them and then take them out and heat them up and you're good to go. So usually in my breakfast burritos I put um, like ground sausage, ground breakfast sausage, five dollar pack from Safeway. And I'm also going to put, I already cut up a jalapeno some and an onion and I'm going to use my ninja chopper to chop that shit up. Then I don't cry so much from the onions because it does make me cry. Oh, here, I should show you, huh? Look at that. Let's pulse it so it's chopped up, and then I can go like this, take the chopper part out, and then we'll put it aside. Don't you love my preparedness? I'm gonna throw some uh, olive oil in the in the pan just a little bit. So I got this big ass pan because a lot of stuff's gonna go in it. Here you can see I already uh, cooked some sweet potatoes, and those will go in there too. It's gonna be a nice hearty uh, bur breakfast burritos. I don't they don't need to be breakfast. Maybe anytime burritos. Who cares? There's no rules. Just like there's no rules in makeup, I don't believe there should be a lot of rules in cooking. So I'm just going to throw the onion. I did one red onion and one jalapeno in here. I took the seeds out, of course. Ooh, this didn't get chopped up all the way. I hope Mark gets those because he likes the spicier stuff. So I'm just kind of getting this all in the pan. Now I'm like on medium-high for cooking. I don't know about this big piece. I might take it out. Yeah. I'm not feeling good about it. This is too big. And if I got it, I would be sad. So far, the Money and Bake pay-per-view, it's only been uh, the pre-show. And it was the Bludgeon Brothers and the Good Brothers. And I like both of these tag teams. But I like the Bludgeon Brothers better. And they won. I think that since Sanity moved up from the NXT roster, then they are going to have a feud with the Bludgeon Brothers. And that should be a good one because that, those are both two really good tag teams. Now I'm going to get the, uh, get the sausage going. And once you get this going and get the sausage going, and it's kind of easy peasy from there. Sometimes I need to rush and make stuff because I don't want the meat to go bad because, man, I hate to waste food. So this is about a pound of... Um, breakfast sausage, but you can use whatever kind you want. It doesn't matter. You can make the ground beef breakfast burrito for all I care. All up to you. So we're just going to brown this up in the big old pan. And I'm kind of letting that up, those sweet potatoes cool down on the strainer so the moisture comes out a little bit more. I'm trying to clean as I go along and yet entertain you at the same time. So 
hope everyone had a nice Father's Day. We went to, me and Mark went to dinner with this family, uh, to brunch with this family, and that was cool. My own father is dead. He passed away of dementia, alcohol-related dementia. Um, probably like five or six years ago. I don't know. I didn't really know him that well, so. But, yeah, so, I'm on my own, except for my mom. All you single parents out there, you're doing a great job. The other thing I need to do is get the eggs. And it's not so much that I'm too lazy to crack the eggs, but why not use it for that instead of cracking the eggs all the time. Let's make quick decisions for our cooking, people, and make it easier on ourselves. Mark. Oh, he's playing a game. I can't, he can't hear me. So I had all this fancy cheese. Oh, I found. Never mind. <laughs> I pulled the cheese already. I'm crazy. So I'm trying some cheeses I've never had before. This uh, well, Monterey Jack with ha jalapeno habanero peppers, and then this cheddar and asadero cheese. I've never had the asadero cheese, so we're gonna throw a bunch of cheese in there. So sometimes I can get Mark to clean this pan up for me because I hate cleaning the big pans. Someday when I grow up, I'd like to have a better way to mount a camera somewhere, but you know, it's a process, people. I'll be back. I'm going to add the eggs. The carton of eggs, if I can open them. Right now, Big Cass and Daniel Bryan are about to go. Um, I'm in a book club with Daniel Bryan on Twitter. Well, I found about it on Twitter, but it's um, called hashtag Why Not Now Read a Book. And so the first book was Factfulness, and I really liked it. And I don't know if the next book's going to be it because I already finished. So I'm just pretty much pouring a whole carton of liquid eggs in here. I'm actually going to turn the heat down a little bit because I don't need to be so hot. So we're going to put those in. And I don't like them hard scrambled. I just like to kind of swish it around a little bit. A gentle, a gentle scramble. Then my new bonus thing I just found at the store which we're pretty excited. So these are fully cooked baking pieces. I know it's this is not a healthy. Well, I guess it might be healthy. Just dumping all those in there. Ooh, not, not the silica pack. It's going to be bad. Um, this isn't like a paleo. But, you know, it kind of is, I guess. But there's, like, there's no milk in it. So as far as I'm concerned, it's paleo. It's a, it won't be paleo because there's tortillas involved. That's the deal. So I'm just kind of cooking the eggs. And I'm going to throw in some. Uh, this is like this kind of like a white trash breakfast burrito, huh? I'm going to throw in some medium paste picante sauce. This is gluten free. Throw some that in there for flavor. Look at that. So I will continue to cook these eggs for a minute. So I cook the eggs till they're like semi-hard. Because remember, this is gonna they're gonna be frozen in the burritos and then you're gonna cook the burritos, so they'll be cooked some more. So it's never worry about to me as long as the meat's all cooked, then we're good to go. I always feel like I'm just showing you my boobs on these on these cooking videos. Damn, I need to get a good camera that I can mount up somewhere and you can have a better view of everything. Besides my boobs. Alright. I'll be back. Well, great news. Big cast tapped out, so Daniel Bryan won. Right now I'm heating up tortillas. Mark, can you come back for your training? 
No. <laughs> He's being camera shy today. I don't know why. So I've just I just heat up uh, about four tortillas at a time. These are the Mission Super Soft. They're like burrito size, it says. So I kind of do this number. I grab about a two-thirds a cup, two-third cup or so. Doesn't have to be perfect. So I kind of dump it in the middle there. You don't want to do too much. Your burrito, will, your burrito will burst. This might be too much just to show you. And then so I'm going to go like this. You can't even see what I'm doing, but I, I assure you that's being folded correctly. So just make sure everything's in the middle, and then you kind of fold it down. So it's going to look like this, kind of like a chimichanga when you buy a chimichanga. And then I put that, I put it on a, on a sheet with a parchment paper, which is slippery so it won't stick to it. And I should try to make this on the... I have a lot of space here in my kitchen, so it's one of those things. So another... The amount that you get out of this is going to vary by how much you put in the tortillas, really. So tortilla number two. And I apologize. I don't have a better way to show you what I'm doing. It's just what I got going right now. Someday. So if I get a ton of new subscribers and everything else, then maybe I'll make a little money. And if I don't, that's okay because I like doing this. So I'm going to do these few. And then I'll get back with you in the next step. Okay? So I'm back. Uh, Mark helped me wrap these. And I'm going to take them out to our chest freezer out, outside in the shed. And I'll have them in there for about 30, 45 minutes. And the reason I do that is so that it can, uh, easy to wrap in foil when I store them. All right, I'll be back. I have a quick check-in with the cats in the cat, cat Zebo that Mark made. Hi. What are you doing? All right. Okay, I'm going to go into the outdoor gym stuff. And, um, don't judge me because of our shed. So, I've had the burritos in here for probably a little over a half an hour. I'm going to go and pull them out. And then we're going to take them in and I'll roll them up in foil and put them in the freezer. And so now all I'm doing is going, I'm going to wrap these in foil. Looks like, so Alexa Bliss just won the women's ladder match in Money in the Bank, which I'm glad about because I... I like her just fine. She's from Ohio. I'm from Ohio. So we got that going. I would like to see Natty or Ember Moon win it. But they got, there's always something to be won later. It's no big deal. But I really like Ember Moon. I really don't like Lana. So I'm glad she did not win. I don't think she's a very good wrestler. But I mean, what can I say? I'm not wrestling. Though I could if I wanted to. So we just wrapped these in the... Oil, put them in a big Ziploc bag and throw it in the fridge. And that's all I got to say about that. Have a good one.